If you want to simplify your trading process, here is my simple tip and that is remember 25, 50, 100, 200 or 250. What does it mean? Means if you want, if you are busy and if you want to only focus on the best opportunities in the market, then focus on the top 25 stocks by momentum in the market. Now, if that is not giving you the opportunity, then expand your universe or you want more opportunities or you have a bigger account, then look for top 50 stocks by momentum. Now, if that is still not enough for you or you're not finding opportunities, then expand it to 100 stocks by momentum or 200 stocks at best 250. If you're going to be looking at more than 250 opportunities, then it leads to a lot of confusion and you get too many opportunities and then you have to prioritize the opportunities. And there are enough opportunities in the top 250 stocks or top 50 stocks by momentum. Now, how do you find these kind of top 10, 50, 100 or 200 or 250 stocks? That again is a function of your time frame of trading. Now, if you are primarily a swing trader and you're looking for a swing trades of say, three to five days duration, then focus on top 25 or 50 stocks by five, 10 or 20 days momentum because what you want to find is something which has a momentum at the moment, right? And because you want to see stocks which are immediately making a move. Uh, now, if you are lo looking at like say holding periods of two to three weeks or four weeks, then accordingly you need to look at around a quarter of momentum. So then in that case, you'll be looking for a momentum based on a quarterly time period. That means around 63 or 65 days. Now, if you are looking for position trades, you're looking for stocks to hold for months, then you need to look at top 25 or 50 or top 100 stocks by six months momentum. Beyond six months momentum, if you start looking at stock, you're going to get into very extended stock. So if you want to simplify your trading, Think about 25, 50, 100, or 200. That is the easiest way you can simplify your life. So let me show you how you can do this for active trading by just looking at focusing on either top 25, 50, or 100, or 200 stocks. And that way, you are always focused on the best opportunity in the market. And in order to do that, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you this on my TC2000. So let's go to TC2000 and when we go to TC2000, now you can create any watch list or like in a typically you create a watch list of stocks which you want to trade. So my watch list of stocks which I want to trade is always US common stock, American depository receipt and I trade stocks priced above $3 and my liquidity condition is 100,000 plus. This is a standard liquidity condition. Now on this particular liquidity condition, once I create this kind of a combination list. So this is created in a combination list. On this combination list, you want to focus on stocks which have momentum in the last 5, 10 or 20 days because as an active trader, you want to be focusing on stocks which have momentum for 5, 10 or 20 days. So in order to do that, what you can do is you can add a column and this is a column which I added which is like and basically if you see, it is just calculating, it is just ranking stocks by five day momentum, right? Stocks which had a five day momentum. Similarly, this is a column which is looking for a 10 day momentum and this is looking for a 25 day momentum. Now, once you rank, you can decide to focus only on the top 25 stocks by momentum. So if you decide only to focus, and this is pre-market, so you need to do it only in the regular hours. So when you have this in the regular hours and when you start looking at stocks, which in the, uh, last couple of days have made the biggest move you're going to find stocks like this immunogen right and so if you decide to focus only so this is an example of a trade which i did yesterday for based on like and looking at stocks which are in the top 25 by momentum on a five day momentum so this stock had like in a gone up and then it had like in a minor pullback and this is the this is when when i saw it breaking out i entered that particular stock and it made a big move basically, right? And it made a big move. So this is the kind of opportunity which you can find. And uh, in terms of like percentage, it almost made a 35% move in one day, right? And basically. 
So when you go and look for the top 25 stocks, you're going to find opportunities like this. Now this is a stock which had this move and it is going sideways. Now the next likely move in the stock might be upside or downside and both sides can offer you an opportunity. So this will become your opportunity. Now this way, when you focus on the top 25 stocks, what you're going to get into is the first or second breakout when they start making a move because stocks break out and once they break out, some of them can go sideways and offer you an opportunity to enter with a low risk. So if you're just going to be focusing on top 25 stocks, uh, by this kind of a momentum, you'll get just one opportunity here, which is basically, uh, this is the stock. Now you can expand this to 50 and at 50, get a lot more opportunities. And uh, this is the kind of thing which you will see on the Stock B public blog, where I uh, have a list of top 50 stocks, which is published every day. Now this is a stock which has made a move. Now this is like, and basically looks like more a reversal than a continuation. But here, if you keep going into the top 25 stocks, again, this was something which was on my radar uh, from day before yesterday because the stock had made a move and it had just a two days pause. So these are the kind of setups you want to find. Now here, you have a setup, which is a good setup. Here, the stock has made a move. It had a gap up. It's going sideways. Now likely to break out. Now you got this opportunity. So you are looking at two opportunities from this particular list. And... Again here, you have United Insurance, which went up, is going three days sideways, so it's a small uh, consolidation from which it can break out. So once you do 50 stocks like this, what you're going to find is opportunities for trading. Now, this is one way of doing it. The same process, you can repeat for 10 days, because when you repeat for 10 days, the stocks which in 10 days made a big move are going to show up. Some of this will be a repetition of the same stock showing up, but as you go into a 25 days kind of a opportunity, you're going to find more and more stocks. And if you don't see that if, if 25 stocks are not enough for you, then you go to 50 stocks. If 50 are not enough, then you can go to 100 stocks. When you go to 100, 200 stocks, you are going to find 10 to 20 opportunities, which becomes your watch list. And it is easiest, easiest way to do a watch list. Now this way, you're always ready and you're always trading stocks which have momentum. So you're not exposing your money to dead stocks. You're looking at like stocks which have momentum and which have momentum pause. And you're going to find a lot of explosive opportunities, especially if you're a short term trader, to trade both on a long and short side because some of the setups which will come from this list are going to be setups where the stock becomes a bull flag, kind of a small bull flag and it has a continuation move. And some of these setups are because when stocks make a very big move in five days, they tend to mean revert, so they can be used for shorting also. So if you are not looking for short term trades and if you're looking for holding periods of slightly longer duration, then you do this using a 65 day period. So for which I have a, a, a indicator called trend intensity and which is a 65 day momentum. So in this case, I have sorted by this particular thing. And I will go through the top 100 stocks this time because this is going to give you much larger list of stocks which are setting up or which are like you know, going to go down basically. Now here you have a stock which made a big explosive move and it is having a very orderly pullback. The volume is very low. So the next likely move on this particular stock is likely to be higher. So that's the kind of stock you want to be watching or that is the kind of a stock where you want to create a price alert. So again, like this is a stock which made a big move going sideways. And once you understand this, you will be able to find a lot of trade with minimum effort because all that you have to do every day is to just look at like you know, 100 stocks or 200 stocks and then set alerts or set orders. Like say in this case, the stock made a big move. It's going sideways. Now that is a good setup uh, for possible breakout buy once it breaks out. And like this, once you keep doing this, you're going to find opportunities in the most trending stocks on a 65 day kind of a time period. For this particular kind of a 65 days kind of a thing, if you focus on 100, you'll find so many stocks. So here, you can create a watch list. And it's a very easy way to find strong stocks by just focusing on either top 25 or 50 stocks 
and I already looked at only like 30 stocks and I already found four or five opportunities here. So many opportunities are lining up, which also tells you underlying buying or selling in the market where opportunities are lining up and then you're on top of these kind of stocks, right, basically. So let's look at like say 50 stocks here. You see like you, know, you have these stocks which are lining up uh, and then once you do the first cut, you can go with a fine tooth comb, look at what is the earnings date, look at if uh, th there is any news or something and then accordingly keep them on your list. So once you do like you know, just 50 stocks, you are going to find so many opportunities like here, you have opportunity lining up, right, in Actus and Pot Belly, right. So this is another, this is like you know, for those who are looking for like slightly longer duration hold because what in this case when you are looking for a three months momentum then the stock has made a move and from the move it is consolidating many of those consolidations can be 10 days, 20 days, 30 days and if there is a 10, 20, 30 days consolidation and if stock breaks out from it, it can go up for one month, two months, three months. Now, if this is something which beyond this you are looking for say position trade, you are looking for something which you want to buy and hold for three months, six months or one year, then all that you do is you use the same approach and change the time period to six months and that way you will find opportunities in the market. So easiest way, easiest way if you are getting completely bogged down by all these uh, too many opportunities and things like that, just do a simple thing. Either focus on 25 stocks by momentum or by 50 stocks or by 100 stocks and if you are an active trader I would suggest focus on top 250 stocks by momentum. There are enough opportunities in stocks with momentum in the top 250 and it is more than enough for you to make enough money in the market. So simplify your process by just focusing on stocks which have momentum either on the time period on which you want to hold if you want to be short term then do 5, 10 or 25 days. If you want to be medium term do 65 days momentum and if you want to be do doing position trading then do 6 months momentum and that way you will be always on top of opportunities in the market.